What's going on YouTube? Wesker Griff coming back with a mail day recap video. Uh, getting back to my old videos guys, going to be doing a recap here. Uh, last two videos I posted were unboxing videos. The If you haven't checked them out, please do. Uh, they're real interesting. The one, uh, the last video was an unboxing for Gundam The Origin. It was a special import uh, collector's Blu-ray Blu edition. Uh, it was a really high-end item. And the other one was just a miniature Gundam stand art that I did. Uh, really enjoy uh, that part. I don't really post those type of videos uh, normally, but I really wanted to make them. And so I, I made them and I put them up. So uh, if you want to check those out, I know they're not sports card related or autograph related, but uh, they were interesting videos and I liked making them. Uh, so for this video, I got one spring train in TTM. I had it in for a really long time. I just never got around to showing it. I also got one uh, Just Because package coming from Facebook, not YouTube. And I got a couple different pickups here uh, from eBay. All these pickups are from eBay bucks, though. So uh, they're technically um, kind of free with my uh, being enrolled in the eBay bucks program. So that's pretty cool. So I'll show, share that with you, too, as well. Uh, but let me show the TTM first. It's coming out of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. And sent to this guy. Was really happy to get back from him. But it's coming back from Philly's pitcher, Mr. David Buchanan. So he signed this rookie card in black Sharpie. So that's really cool. Happy about that. And he also signed this 2015 Tops in black Sharpie. So happy about that as well. And I sent to him in spring training, and he took his mail with him and sent it out from Philadelphia. And I got this back probably like three weeks ago. It's just been a while since uh, I was able to make a mail day video and was able to show that. So sorry about the delay on that. But it did take about 30, 30 days because I sent that out in February, and it didn't come till after uh, the season started. So there's that. And other than that, there hasn't really been any TTMs coming in. It's been very, very slow. Uh, I did okay for spring training. I did get about like 9 to 10 returns back. So I am happy about that. But otherwise, it's been very, very slow. So I uh, just want to uh, let people know that. Uh, next, the pickups uh, that I got for my eBay bucks. Uh, there are a bunch of different PCs here. Uh, this first card I picked up for my Flyers PC. This was super, super cheap. I think it was like $4 shipped. I got it from a seller in Canada, uh, so it took a little longer. Maybe that's why it was cheap. But uh, nice signature sensations here out of Upper Deck 2014-2015 Series 1 of Flyers goalie Ray Emery. So pick that up. Happy about that. Uh, the next card here I picked up for my Sixers PC. This is numbered out of 199. I This guy's probably not going to be on the team next year. But it is from 2014-2015 Panini, Panini Threads. Like I said, numbered out of 199 of Henry Sims. So I picked that up for, I think, $4 shipped as well. So real cheap autograph, so happy to pick that up. Uh, next card I picked up, wanted to pick up a card of this guy. I paid a little more than I wanted to, but it was with the eBay box, so I didn't care. Uh, this is numbered out of 50. It's the blue uh, parallel version. This is from uh, Tribute, uh, 2013 Tribute. This guy's really starting off really hot, and I want to pick an autograph up of him, but it's coming from Mr. Mike Moustakis. So a nice Mike Moustakis Tribute Auto, numbered out of 50. So it was like, I think it was $20, but... Like I said, I got it for free with my eBay bucks, so happy to pick that up. He's really starting off good. I drafted him in most of my fantasy leagues. I think I drafted him in every league but one, and he's just been really, really good. I think he went, on ESPN, he went from like 5% owned all the way up to, I think he's up to 85% now, so that's cool. Uh, and finally, this last card here, it's a non-PC card. I picked this up solely because of Ricky Russo, uh, but this is numbered out of six ninety nine, and this is a hockey card. And you guys know 
I'm like a really extremely casual hockey fan. Like I have a Flyers PC. I support the Flyers. I watch the Flyers. But I'm an extremely casual hockey fan. You don't really see too many hockey cards uh, on my channel or in my videos. But I've been watching a ton of breaks. Uh, and Ricky PCs this guy. I just like the way Ricky says his name. And uh, just wanted to pick him up. So I picked this up on my eBay bucks as well. Numbered out of $6.99. Autograph of Jonathan Hubadu. A.K.A. Scooby Doo, and I talked about this guy. There's a guy that I work with who's a really diehard hockey fan, and I told him that I picked this up, and he told me that I keep saying his name wrong, but I don't really care because it's, it's funny. It's pretty cool, but happy to uh, pick that up, Mr. Scooby Doo. So there you go, Ricky. So happy to get that. And then last, the Facebook care package. It is coming from my friend Max. Uh, I met Max in person uh, at a card show. Uh, if you guys remember, if you don't, it actually was a real long time ago. Oh, I should say a long time ago. It was a year ago uh, when I went to the Lenny Dykstra in person sign. I actually helped him get an item sign. But he sent me a nice note here. He put, hey, Eddie. I was at the local card shop buying some cards for my vintage sets, and I got you some too. I know you collect vintage cards, so I figured you enjoy these. I know the brown ate the best, but he signs TTM. Enjoy the cards, man. Hope to see you at the Wildwood show this summer, Max. And I do plan on attending the Wildwood card show. Uh, the Wildwood card show, if you guys aren't familiar, it's like it's a pretty decent sized show. It's in the convention center. It's free to the public. They get like a bunch of dealers, card dealers, you know, there's like toy dealers in there, Funko dealers. It's just a whole bunch of stuff and they usually get players signed into. But it's a fun time. I met Max down there and um, talked to him and um, uh, gave him this Dykstra ball that I got signed because the Lenny Dykstra signing was that week. So um, yeah, good dude. And he sent me uh, some really nice stuff here. All vintage cards. We got a 1968 Rookies. Ron Stone and Frank Peters. Now, all these guys I'm going to have to see if they sign because I will maybe try to get some of these guys TTM American League Orioles card because I've been really making a conscientious effort to try to get older cards signed and maybe try to get them slabbed for PSA or pick up certified uh, vintage slab PSA cards of either Orioles or Phillies. So I know the two cards I submitted for Anthony Funky Diabetic One's PSA submission. Both of them were vintage cards uh, that I got signed up Team TTM. So we'll see if they pass. Whitey Lockman, Charlie Beamon. So I'm gonna have to check to see if these guys sign. Jack Harshman. We got Tim McCarver, who I know doesn't sign. Randy Lurch. Hoyt Wilhelm. And Hal Brown. So I have to check to see if these guys sign. So thank you very much, Max, for thinking of me and sending me that way, man. Greatly, greatly appreciate it. I would put your link down below, but uh, like I said, guys, he doesn't make YouTube videos. He's uh, involved in the Facebook group, so... There's that. So other than that, that's all I got for you guys today. So thank you guys for watching. Leave a comment down below. Tell me what you think. And take care. Uh, have a good one. Peace.